hi guys welcome back to my channel so today I am gonna be teaching you guys how I curl my hair with a flat iron as opposed to using a curling iron so if you're interested please keep watching hi I'm Robin Taylor and here I do makeup tutorials reviews and giveaways so if you're new here please consider subscribing and let's get right into this video all right this is a water wave 24 inches lace front wig from March Queen and it is a water wave I just straight it yesterday because I wanted to have these really big loose curls today and honestly I'm kind of getting tired of having water wave hair because for me I feel like water wave hair sheds too much yeah so I'm just gonna brush the hair out from being in that ponytail this is literally how long the hair is sorry like oh, if you guys don't know she's pregnant Woo! Okay, so yeah, so this is as long as it goes, so it's down all the way to my waistline. It's a lot of hair, but we're gonna do this. Usually I go for middle parts, but I've had a middle part for a while now, so I decided to do a side part. It's super long, oh my goodness. All right, so next what I'm gonna do is just grab the top half of the hair, like this, and then I'm gonna pin that up. going to take two sections right in the front and what I like to do is start from the very end that way it's easier to lay it down and then get to the next hair if you start doing it from the top it's really hard to like curl your hair so before I get the flat iron what I'm going to use is the Moroccan oil defense protect it is a heat protected and I'm just going to spray that just a little bit on the hair this flat iron was sent to me from Duvall. I have used their products before and I am absolutely in love. So what I'm gonna do is curl the hair and twist it from right where I want the curl to start and curl it towards my face and then sliding it down and controlling the hair so it doesn't get frizzy like this. And then do you see you get your little cute curls I'm just gonna do that throughout my head I'm gonna get another section and brush it out and you want to get a small enough section where everything does curl you don't want to get a really big section and then you have some straight strands so again I'm gonna hold it right here and then curl it towards my face and I'm going to do that slowly. And then you have another curl. Girl, I really wish I was going out somewhere, but I'm not going nowhere. I'm so mad. <laughs> like, one, I'm pregnant, so I can't really go anywhere, but like, like, you can't even go to dinner because it's quarantine, but I'm gonna take some Instagram pictures, so make sure you follow me on Instagram, okay? And comment down a hashtag quarantine <laughs> because it can't go nowhere, man. Like, ugh. I'm so mad like it's so annoying how you want to like go somewhere and then you can't because literally nothing is open and the only things that are open are like Walmart so what am I gonna go to Walmart and look cute for like I look like I'm ready to fight the flat iron <laughs> Ooh, that was a cute one so you guys want to know something I didn't realize that I'm wearing a pink shirt and my lips are pink and my eyes are pink and my flat iron is pink you would think my favorite color is pink but it's not it's yellow actually my favorite color is yellow and my second favorite color is green just in case any of you guys want to date me but 
but I'm sure no straight men are watching how to curl your hair with a flat iron, so. Just forget what I said, because it don't even make sense. One thing about these curls is that it's super easy to do if you have somewhere to go, like work, and you want really fast curls. It's not something like a wand curl where you have to hold it, like you twist it, then you hold it for a while, but also this way you can use your straightener for multiple things. I really do like this Duvall straightener because it did straighten this hair, which I'll show you guys a clip of it. It did straighten this hair when it was um, a water wave curl and it was super curly. So it did straighten that, which is what you saw before I started doing these curls. And now it's curling the hair. This flat iron does go up to 450 Fahrenheit, girl. So it gets hot, hot like me. That didn't even make any sense. My camera's about to die. Let me change the battery. All right, I'm back. So, I have pet turtles, right? I got two pet turtles, and this whole time I thought these turtles were boys, so I named them Steve and Patrick, but they're girls. So now I don't know what to name them. Ow! Anyway, so they're girls, and now I don't know what to name them, and I, like, so I need you guys' help. Comment down below what I should name my two pet turtles. They're both girls, and I really can't think of something cute for them. I don't even have a name for my son. And we got three months to go. <laughs> I'm just so indecisive and I feel like my son just deserves like the best name in the world. So I don't know what to name him. Like he don't deserve just like a regular degler schmegler ass name. Like, and my turtles keep thinking that I'm gonna eat them. Girl, like, I got chicken in the freezer. Speaking of that, I gotta take the steak out. Your girl wanna have some steak with some asparagus, yeah. Oh, I forgot to spray this on. Let me just spray it on the rest of the hair. So now I don't forget. I'm so proud of this hair. Hair review coming soon. No matter what I do, all I think about is you. Oh, see, just like that, we're almost done, girl. Like, it's not that too, it's not that much. I thought it was gonna take me hours. And what I do is just twist it like this so the curls can last a little longer. And then that way they can mold into that little curl shape. Just again, I'm gonna show you guys. For the people in the back, just kidding. I'm gonna take the flat iron and I'm gonna take it to the very bottom of where the heating plates are. And then I'm gonna rotate towards my face I'm going to take the bottom and flip it over and then I'm going to hold right here, watch your hands if you have those heat protecting gloves, use it but I'm African so our hands never burn. And then you're just going to twist while you're pulling down and then twist while you're pulling down. And if you have a wig be careful because you don't want to pull your wig off. And then after I curl. I just take my hand and twist it and then put it to the back like so like that. I don't know what picture to take though like I've been really feeling my most sexiest while I'm pregnant. I don't know why it's weird. My son's about to be like ma what are you doing? But yeah like so this is my first child. Um, 
out of six. Just kidding. With how Corona is going, your girl is probably only gonna be able to afford one kid. So yeah, I've been really feeling like my most sexiest being pregnant. Like I have like certain insecurities and stuff. Like usually don't break out like normally, but I've been breaking out. Not crazy, but more than usual being pregnant and it's just been a weird, a very weird insecurity of mine, but it's not that bad where I'm like totally upset over it. And my symptoms haven't been that bad either. So I really feel like I'm gonna take some nice, like sexy, womanly Instagram pictures. Nothing like insane, like titties out and stuff like that. Well, maybe. I'm just kidding. Nothing like that, but definitely something that is like, I don't know, sexy. You know, sexy don't gotta be raunchy. Make sure you follow me, cause we'll see how this goes. When I get to the top here, I'm gonna curl it in a way for it to have a bump right at the top. Y'all remember bump it? Like, I want it to be like a little, like, bump right here. Y'all remember bump it? Like that little thing that people would put on there. Am I showing my age? Ew, I'm not even old enough to say am I showing my age. I'm only 25. All right, so I'm done with this side. I'm gonna go to this side. And I already did some curls on this side. But what I'm gonna do for this side is curl it away from my face. Dang, like, I can't even, like, go to work to even look cute. But yeah, so I'm just gonna grab it like this and turn it away from my face. And then twist it down. So it's literally the same method, but you're twisting it. Like your curl is going away from your face. Like that. But yeah, I'm so mad. Quarantine ruins so much, man. This flat iron is not expensive at all. Let me show y'all the price. So this flat iron is usually $95, but I got a coupon code, wait a second. So the coupon code for you guys to get this flat iron is 70SHOP, and I'll put it on the screen and down below with the website for you guys. So it's a good and expensive flat iron and it's cute and I've used Duvall's products before and absolutely love it my cousin's facetiming me let's see what she wants you're on my video right now so they're gonna hear everything you're saying oh wait are you putting this in the video yes I don't care period Period. I don't know how this randomly got into my mind, but honestly, I don't remember getting into any fights in high school. Like, I almost did, but I always got out of them because my dad, this is about to sound like so conceited. I'm really not a conceited person at all. But my dad used to, my dad used to always tell me like, don't get into fights because you're a pretty girl. They're gonna go after your face. I was just like, dang daddy, well thank you. But, so I just never got into fights because I was always scared so I was gonna go like attack my face. So even if someone's like, I'm ready to fight you, I'd be like, but why? But why do you wanna fight me? This girl tried to fight me in high school. Was it high school? Middle school. Middle school? Yeah, middle school. And she was like, I'm I'm gonna fight you after we get off the bus because I heard you don't like me because I'm too loud on the bus. Which she was loud on the bus, but like, yeah, but like, and I told her, I was just like, okay, so that makes no sense. Like, even if you fight me, like, you're gonna fight me because you feel like I don't like you, yeah? And she said, yeah. And I was like, okay, well, if you fight me after, I'm still not gonna like you. So what is the issue? Like, how is this gonna solve anything? So I just always spoke logic into things <laughs> and always like was able to talk out of getting into fights because I don't know if you guys know, but I'm also like five feet. I'm literally five feet and I'm a little thicker now, but I was like 110 pounds maximum in high school. So imagine how how tiny I was in middle school and those girls I don't know what they were eating but them chicken nuggets had way too many hormones in there because they were fully developed and I was a little ass girl I was so little like I didn't even get boobs till like after high school I had boobs senior year that's when I got my boobs but like in middle school these girls were like huge so she was trying to fight little old me and I was just like oh no you're not gonna rub my hairstyle like my mom just did my hair for me like absolutely not for whose lip gloss to rub on whose shoulder 
killed her. Like, absolutely not. I just like talked my way out of it. And she ended up not fighting me, but she still needed to get her weird, aggressive behavior out on somebody. So then she ended up fighting this other girl that went to the same, like, was on the same bus stop as us, which was very stupid. I don't know when this stopped filming, but I moved on to the other side. So anyway, then I was in middle school. I mean, yeah, middle school, eighth grade. And the girl actually, this is another girl, we actually became friends, best friends afterwards, but she brought liquor to school and got suspended. And we had a mutual friend, and the mutual friend told her that I did not like her eat, like, oh yeah, a Robina doesn't like you because you brought liquor to school, blah, blah, blah. And I was just like, what? That makes no sense. So she came up to me, she approached me, she was like, I heard you didn't like me because I brought liquor to school. I was like, first of all, I don't care if you did bring liquor to school. Second of all, why would that make me not like you? Like, I don't, like, that makes no sense. And then, so yeah, so she was gonna fight me. But then it just so happened to be eighth grade and it was like senior year of eighth grade. So we were graduating middle school and I was gonna go to a different high school than the rest of them. So I ended up leaving. And I'm like, oh yeah, I don't have to deal with this girl anymore. So summer went by, went to high school, and my first class in high school was a math class. And it was like, I don't know, but there was an empty seat where I was sitting down and there was an empty seat. Guess who that empty seat was for? The girl that was trying to fight me. So then my random math teacher was just like, okay, I'm gonna pair you and you together and do a group project. We were both like, Oh, hell no, hell no. And then we had to tell her the whole history. They sent us to the office. She was ready to fight me. We were yelling, jumping on tables and stuff. It was really weird. And then we went to the office and nothing really happened because we were just like, they're like, why don't you guys like each other again? Like this is the first day of high school. And then we were both like, Honestly, it's not even that big of a deal. <laughs> and she was my friend for like over 10 years. We just like had a falling out or whatever, but whatever. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna do is just run my fingers through these curls. And I really want those nice curls. And then when it comes to right here in the front, I'm gonna bump it. And I'm gonna bump it like holding my flat iron right here and then just curling it like that. So then it has that little lift right there. And you just wanna lightly brush it out, not all the way, so then you can have those loose, huge curls. Get the other side. Alrighty, this is it for this tutorial on how to curl your hair using a flat iron featuring Duval. I'll make sure I link all their information down below for you guys. Honestly, love this look. I haven't done my hair like this in a while. Like, y'all make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. I'm so serious because I'm really about to go in with these pictures. If you guys want story times of my high school experience with females and males and everybody like make sure you comment down below and then i will make sure to give you guys story times because i just realized like my life was definitely like a movie there's so much drama that happens in my life even as a high schooler even outside of high school like there were so many things that happened. So if you guys are interested, please let me know and I will give you guys story times about that. Make sure you subscribe because I do do makeup. I do do, okay, sorry, sorry. I do makeup tutorials and giveaways as well. So make sure you guys do subscribe. I love you guys so much for watching throughout the end, if you did. And until next time, I will talk to you beauties later. Bye.